We are home from the gym. It is now 6.45. She leaves every morning around 7.10. Her school starts at 7.30. Eight forty four. We're doing good. Bye. Bye. Goodbye now. Goodbye now. Bye now. Bye now. Goodbye. It's four nineteen in the morning. Taking the dogs outside. Just got up. Get ready to go to the gym. Come on. If you guys have watched this a long time, you guys know that I do laundry in the morning. Well, I just throw a load in. This was from last night. I need to actually take this downstairs to Kesley. But this is morning. I like to throw a load in just while I'm gone, and then when I get home, I just transfer it over. And I feel like I just got like a little head start of the day, if that makes sense. There's nothing in the dryer. I took that out, folded it, and taken it down to Kesley. But I'm gonna throw this in. And then we're gonna start our day heading to the gym. I'm already dressed, wearing my gym clothes. I'm gonna go make my pre-workout, unless Corey already did. And we're heading out. Corey went downstairs and filled my water bottle up with pebbled ice. This is the water bottle I drink while I'm doing cardio. And then he filled this one up too. And this is what I drink when I'm doing like my weight training. So I put my pre-workout in here and I use the upper limit. And I love this one. I love the peach flavor. Um, I have a coupon code if you're interested, but you guys can try it. It's so good. Yeah. He likes the Tiger's blood flavor. So he did that one on his drink, but I'm gonna hurry. Get going because now it's 4:40. We are home from the gym. It is now 6:45. Let me tell you one thing that made me really mad this morning. I left my phone at home. In my mind, I had it in the car with me when we were driving down, and I was usually I kind of like get on it and like I'm looking at my workout, what to do. But I was just having a conversation with Corey all morning as we were driving to the gym, and we get there and I get my water bottles to get out. Oh, she's really wanting to go outside. I had two huge laundry baskets full of folded clothes and I set my phone on top of one of them and Corey took the other one downstairs. So when I went down there, it was dark. I just laid it next to her door. I didn't even open her door and I walked back upstairs, grabbed my water bottles, put my pre-workout in and Corey's like, I looked at it. He looked it up well, on I the I find my iPhone and I it know, was. And, and he started ringing it and then I heard it. So you I caught it. I was thinking it was in the car, so I was ringing it. Yeah, no, I, I, yeah, you rung it and I was like, like I was like, Asleep, and then I was like, Oh my, like someone's phone's going off inside. Yeah. I looked, it was mine, and then I had text out, I was like, It's in the laundry basket. I'm like, No, so yeah, I had to do a workout. I Corey was nice enough to let me use his phone to download my app and do my workout, and then I gave it to him. And then I went running for 30 minutes on the um, treadmill. We are gonna make some breakfast before Kisley heads out to school this morning. I think our most traditional thing lately has been like Kodiak pancakes and eggs. Um, we still don't have a refrigerator. Our refrigerator is still broken, which has been so much fun. Huh, Corey? I think somebody's walking them down from Canada. <laughs> the parts, like literally walking them down. <laughs> if you haven't been keeping up on our channel, our fridge broke again when we got back from a trip. And then look, and I'm not, like, this is just so sad. It's empty. Both. It's turned off and it's warm. We have um, a mini fridge in our basement, which we've been keeping some of our food in, and we have a free fridge and a freezer on the garage that we've been able to keep some food. But I'm telling you, I missed my refrigerator in my kitchen because then I don't know. I have just I just fell off. It's our week for cool, um, carpool this week, so Corey will drive Rhett and um, the kids that we're supposed to pick up this morning at eight o'clock, and then I will drive the girls to their school at nine. <sighs> just this week, I don't know, it's crazy. And then, yeah, like Kesley just kind of hangs out in the morning, she usually gets like a protein shake, and then we get some breakfast, and then she'll just head out. You've been getting up early too in the morning, haven't you? So, so you you guys leave to the gym. Yeah, so she's getting up early and just getting ready and stuff. And she even put all her laundry away this morning and that I brought down. Yeah, I put one. I have one more, but I'm gonna do it after school. Yeah. Don't you feel like Kesley's just grown up so much and just the last like becoming very like, independent. very independent. She's like ready to move out on her own. And I'm so proud of her. She's done so well with her um, her businesses and she's um, saved a lot of money. And I'm just I'm just proud of her. She's gonna do great on her own and and I'm I don't know. We just we're are really proud of her. So I know she is excited to continue to do what she's doing. Anyway, she's just awesome. And 
We've just seen so much growth in you. We've just seen so much growth in you. This cute shirt. Stay tuned, you guys. Come into Kesley Jade's shop. Yep. So another, like I said, another awesome business thing of Kesley. She's killing it. I came in to check on Rhett. It looks like he's already up getting ready for school. And guys, look, he's wearing jeans. If you guys know Rhett, he doesn't often wear jeans, but he's been wearing them a lot more lately. Kesley's heading out to school. Yep. She leaves every morning around 7.10. Her school starts at 7.30. She's heading out. Teresa's peanut butter cups. How's Miss Sophia doing this morning? Good morning, Soph. How are you, Bufos? Good morning, Reese. And you see, you, you followed me in here because you love Sophia, huh? You love Sophia so much. This dog is still so fascinated by that bird. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> you guys, this makes me laugh so hard. She, uh, little Miss Perry Brielle, will sleep on top of her already made bed. You are so funny. <laughs> Why don't you sleep inside the sheets? Because it doesn't want to make my bed. It's not that hard. <laughs> <laughs> you just zip. Corey just made fun of the way I opened up my box of protein. Well, I'm gonna put it in my container. You didn't open it up, you exploded. <laughs> Is there a, a way you're supposed to with this one? I didn't see a direction that says pull here. If there's anything in our marriage that he can't stand, it's the way I open up packages. Yeah, Cause like I, I just rip. It up. You just rip the and I rip them, and that's just how it is. Like I don't really. Corey's like, there's a thing that says open here. I'm like, oh, I didn't see that there. <laughs> yeah, like we were eating licorice, and my mom opened it. Like <laughs> so weird. <laughs> what happens to licorice if you don't seal it back up? I know it gets hard. We've been through this. I forgot we're out of egg whites, so I need to get some more. So I'm gonna use Premier as the extra source of protein to put in my Kodiak pancake. So I do half a cup of Kodiak, and I'm gonna dump almost all of this in it, and that will give me like lots and lots of protein. I really try to get about 100 and between like 130 and 150 grams of protein every single day. So this is a good way to get it, because this has 30 grams, and then this has a lot too, I can't remember. I think this has like 18. This is a great alternative than using butter. So if you want to put this on top of your pancakes in place of butter, it's great and it tastes yummy. The girls are finishing up their breakfast. Corey finished, Rhett finished, I finished. And we're just sitting here talking about our day. And this is usually what we do every morning. So the girls, I need to go do their hair still, but Rhett is gonna be leaving in about 20 minutes to school. Um, it's light outside, which is nice. We, we recently had the time change and it just feels good to like look outside and it's light outside. It's so nice. But we have a very busy day after school. So Reese and Perry are going to tumbling. Rhett's soccer season's over, but he still practices one day a week and that's today. And so yeah, that's kind of what we're doing today. It's gonna be like a normal, simple, but busy day after school because it's right after school. So I have to hurry and get them something to eat right when they get home and then Rhett doesn't have practice till a bit later. But then we gotta do homework when they get home and it's just, yeah, it's just, it's fun but chaotic at the same time. Kitchen's cleaned up. Corey's just cleaning the stove. Last time you guys were very intrigued by it, but this is how we clean it. He just pours water on it when it's hot. Steam kind of melts away all the grease. Now I'm gonna go upstairs and help Reese and Perry with the hair and Corey's gonna take Rhett to school right now. They have to head out and Sometimes, I'll tell you what, now not all the time, but sometimes these guys go for, with daddy for rides in the car, huh? This is something um, Kesley used to have. It's funny, because Kesley's been giving Reese all of her old clothes, which is kind of fun. I had Reese come up here. She will lay on the stool. This dog really does do this all the time. I had Reese sit on the stool. She put her legs out, and Lucy jumps up here, and she just... Like, should I sit on there? Just... No. It's so beautiful. He's so pretty baby. So this is what she, she likes to follow us around and then she'll come up and either sit on her lap or she'll sit oh, behind her legs like that. Beautiful. Yeah, you lay right hey, there. I just part her hair down the middle and then we're just gonna do one of her favorite hairstyles. A lot of you have asked about Perry's hair right here in the front. 
when she had her hair back in one of these elastics, she was trying to take it out and so she cut it out herself, so she made some bangs. <laughs> and now she's like, I hate them, but it's okay, they'll grow. They will grow out, it's gonna be all right. But yeah, she doesn't love that so much. She's gonna have her hair curled today and then we will tame that front piece. Girls are ready for school. Corey took Rhett to school. It's only 8.15 and I'll be honest, as a mom, I don't love school starting at nine. My kids last year were in school at eight and they were done by two. This year they're in school by nine and out by 3.30 and I don't love it. We just kind of waste a lot of time in the morning. They're just ready to go to school. But what they do is they'll, <laughs> they'll get on their phone and they'll create dances or TikToks or whatever and just hang out in the morning until school starts or they'll watch some TV or something. That's usually how we do it around here. And then we leave about 8.50 to school and I, uh, or whoever is carpooling picks them up about 8.50 and they head out the door. Reese is downstairs. In fact, where did she go? I was gonna have her show you. I posted on Instagram, but it is the cutest dance. She and Perry both created the cutest dance. It's two. Wrecking ball. Wrecking ball. I need to fold all of this this morning, so I'm gonna do this as soon as the kids get off to school, or I can even do it now because I have time. They are gonna show you their dance. We're gonna have to change the music, but just know it starts with, I will always want you, and then it goes, I came in like a wrecking ball, and then yeah, you can see it like, as she's doing a cartwheel, it's I came in with like a wrecking ball. If you guys wanna watch it with the music, go over to Instagram on the dot Leroy's, and you guys can watch it there. But okay, ready and go. Had a few people on Instagram say though they want to see a whole dance. They're like, is there more to this? Because I want to see more of this. They're like, this was so good. They totally created it on their own. It was so awesome. Kids' clothes are folded. So Perry's, Reese's, and Red Stash. Red's been doing pretty good about keeping his room clean. I had another piece to his bedroom set coming here, but it's on back order, so I don't have it yet. But he was gonna put like all of his trophies and medals on it. It's gonna be really cool, but um don't have it yet. <laughs> And so, anyway, like I said, he's been keeping his closet pretty clean and organized. His bed is not made, but that's okay. I don't, I ask my kids to make their beds in the morning, but if they don't make it, it's not like it's a big deal. I mean, sometimes I'll just come in and do it for them. And we love Betty's. This is Betty's. We absolutely love it so much. Um, this is such a cute um, bedding for boys. But yeah, so easy, zip, done. And I just gotta add to put the pillows on. My bed is made, we are good to go. We have 10 minutes now, just helping Perry fold up her clothes. Got her jeans, we went through her closet and drawers the other day and it was so nice, like we got rid of all the pants that don't fit, we organized her drawers, got all of her shorts and skirts. It just feels good to have some organization. These are all of her pajamas and her dance clothes. Let's get these hung up right here. Yeah. And her bed's already made because she didn't sleep, <laughs> didn't sleep in it. <laughs> she slept on it. <laughs> so funny. Fold your blankets up and then put hippo and horsey in your swing. Now we're gonna help Reese make her bed. Simple, easy, zip it. And done. This is also from Betty's. Perry's is just like this one, but in cream. Bedroom, clean, done. Bird is fed, bird has water. Daily's happy. Daily's happy, blankets are clean, right? Does yeah. that need to go in your closet? Okay, mm -hmm. everything is done guys. Everyone's rooms are picked up. Okay, 844, we're doing good. We've accomplished a ton this morning. Another thing I do every morning is I feed my sourdough starter. So I got my fourth of a cup of flour and then a fourth of a cup of water. I just stir it and then I just let it sit all day. I love sourdough bread, I love making it. It's so easy and my kids love it so much. 853, ready to go? In the car, let's go. Come on Lucy, Bay, you guys wanna come? You guys like going for right time. So excited. Oh my gosh. We have Ivy here. Hi Ivy. Hi. Hey. Let's go get the next person. We got Kaylee here. 
Okay, we're ready to go. Everyone's in the car and Bailey's ready too. Let's go. Bye, bye, goodbye now, goodbye now, bye now, bye now, goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Five, four, three, two, one. Bye guys. Bye.